quick was just the end of that series. A couple of guys we've talked to already said we had the reigning champions with a 4-2 lead and, you know, late in the game, could have pushed them to a game seven, and you don't know what happens. How much have you thought about that over the last three days? Yeah, it's frustrating, you know, uh, especially when we were up uh, in that game 4-2, we were playing well. Um, you know, I think if we would have went to, you know, their intermission up 4-2, there would have been a different result. You got a little emotional after that loss and, you know, a lot of things kind of going on, blowing the lead, you're hurting and stuff like that, some of the turnovers and things like that. Have you had a moment to kind of kind of digest it all and kind of calm down or is it still sting, is it still hurt that you guys weren't able to pull it off? Yeah, I mean, definitely still hurts. Uh, I mean, I hate losing. What can I say? Um, I think we got you know a lot of competitors in the room, and uh, you know it's frustrating to be out right now, you know, because definitely thought we could have played and uh, uh, you know uh, could win the series. So uh, yeah, it's definitely frustrating, but you know nothing we can do now. We just gotta you know learn from it and uh, come back stronger next year. I mean, they leave it up to you. Uh, I mean, I did all the t tests uh, with all the doctors before a game, and uh, you know, uh, they said I was good to go, and it was up to me then. You know, and uh, like I said, uh, you know, uh, as long as my arm was attached, I was playing. So, you know, it was uh, it was really frustrating uh, going down, uh, you know, playing in the third period where I was start was starting to, you know lose the feel for my arm and uh, lost the puck a bunch of times and turned it over and uh, you know but uh, as a competitor it's so you know hard to uh, you know not be out there and uh, not try to do everything to help the team win.